Hey guys, this is Darren with East Woodland Survival. Today uh, I'm going to talk about uh, making rawhide glue. It's a real easy process. Uh, I've got a piece of rawhide back here that's been drying for about a week now. In here it's getting pretty good. Uh, getting dried out and almost ready to use. Uh, this is a finished product. You end up with a, a strip like this. At one time, this was pretty much like uh, Pioneer duct tape, basically, and uh, it's really good stuff. Uh, you can see one of my videos I did on rawhide cordage. But uh, today we're going to talk about rawhide glue. Uh, there's no need in wasting any of this. <clears throat> Make great dog chews. Uh, your dogs would love them. Uh, you can also cut these pieces up and just kind of shave off little pieces and bits. Little pieces like this off these smaller pieces. And just kind of put them in a cup like that. We're going to boil these down and make rawhide glue. I've got a pretty good little pile shaved up already in here. I'm going to add some water to this. I've already got some water going on the fire. And uh, we'll uh, boil this down. I'll show you what the glue looks like after it sets up. It takes about an hour, something like that, to really boil it down and uh, get all the good stuff out of it. And uh, we'll time lapse that. Come back in about an hour and I'll show you what it's like. Just put some water in there, uh, pretty hot water, been setting for a while, and uh, we're going to uh, cap this off, and I'm just going to use another recycled can, just cap that thing off, and we're going to move it over to the fire first. Clear out a good spot here. And we're going to wait for about an hour. You can kind of see it's just simmering here. Uh, I really don't want this going to a big rolling boil or anything, uh, so I'm just kind of adjusting it back and off the fire. Uh, if it looks like it's cooling down, I can put this top back on it and uh, kind of uh, keep the heat in, heat it up some more. Just going to set, got about 30 more minutes to go, and then we're going to straighten this off using a piece of cheesecloth. Okay guys, our hot glue's been uh, simmering down. It's been about an hour and a half or so. You can see the water's reduced down to about half its size, boiled out or simmered out, evaporated off. Uh, right now I'm going to take a uh, just, just a piece of uh, cheesecloth we're going to use to strain this with. I'm just going to put it in a little cup. We'll set it over here on this flat rock to where you can see what I'm doing. I'm just going to take my multi-tool and uh, pull this uh, pan off with the hide in the hide glue in it, and we're going to strain this out a little bit. Just going to pour real slow. Get all that good stuff in there. Okay, you can see we've got kind of a it's kind of like a jello when it sets up. Uh, you want to heat this back up a little bit to use it. Okay guys, you can see it's kind of like a, uh, a jello thing. 
Uh, this will actually set up like a gel, and uh, you can use it uh, as a gel. Um, it's easier if you kind of soften it back up, just kind of warm it back up a little bit. And uh, it actually glues pretty well. It is kind of heat sensitive though, so you don't want to get like something really hot this is going to be adhered to. You know, uh, you don't really want to put this on a uh, something that's going to have a lot of heat to it because the, the bond will come undone. But uh, there are several good videos on YouTube on uh, how this stuff glues up. There's a guy I got one that's got some uh, uh, raw hot glue he put together with wood, put some wood together with it, and uh, the bond held really well until he heated it, of course. And uh, But uh, glue, I mean, that's pretty much, you, you need it sometimes uh, in the wilderness. And this is a really easy way to get some glue. Uh, and I just like using recycled items so uh, you know just old cans like this work great for uh, a glue pot and I will uh, probably put some more water in this and try to extract some more uh, glue out of it although it looks like it's about done well guys this is Darren with East Woodland Survival I really appreciate you guys viewing I really appreciate your comments I hope you guys subscribe uh, Thank you for watching. Thanks for everything that you do. Uh, and I hope to see you guys in the woods.